Hi everyone. Okay, hello everybody. Hello everyone. Everybody. Hello. Hello. Hi. Uh, my name is Eric. My name is Teacher Will. My name is Teacher Emerald. Uh, my name is Teacher Jess. My name is Jonathan. My name is Teacher Connor. Uh, my name is Handsome Teacher Sight. <laughs> students to learn and to improve their lives and helping them get through the challenges of English. I wanted to be a teacher so I could travel. I wanted to live in other countries outside of England and meet lots of wonderful people around the world. And I wanted to do something that was fun and different. I've been a teacher for about 26 years. For 12 years. 20 years. Uh, 22 years now. Almost 10 years. 22 years. <laughs> 25 years now. First started teaching in South Africa. Then I went to Taiwan, in Korea, Japan and China. And uh, now I'm in Thailand. I taught in London. I taught in Japan for about 7 years. Uh, before I was a kindergarten teacher and I've also taught business people. I've taught in the UK and Thailand mainly. I taught in Italy first and then I taught in South Korea. But now I teach primary one and primary two in Satichula. First started teaching in British Council Morocco. In British Council Spain, British Council Malaysia, British Council Korea, Korea. I'm now British Council Thailand. I love Thai food. I like the food. Food. Well, it's very delicious. I don't like cold weather in England. Yeah, I love the weather. Uh, I love traveling in Thailand, I love the beaches, I love the mountains and the forests and Thai food as well. And I really enjoy uh, speaking and meeting people in Thailand. Um, most of the students are very nice, most of the students. I fell in love with Thailand when I came on holiday, it's a very nice place to live. So I wanted to live here. My favorite Thai food is Pak Kapao. Uh, it is Kapao. Kapow! Kapow! Because it's really flavorful and delicious, and I love to eat it with a fried egg on top. Oh, it's mugatyang and gaomuyang with namjin gel. Green curry. Actually, before it was green curry, now it's duck lap. That is somtan because I like spicy food. Oh, a lot of Thai food. I like to eat isan foods like nam tok komuyang, ao niao. Uh, mu tod, som tam thai, som tam khao pot, uh, any Eastern foods, set set. Uh, on weekends, I like to take a walk in the park and I also like to watch YouTube and relax at home. Uh, watch football. Usually, I like watching Netflix or doing food hopping or restaurant hopping where you try different restaurants. Um, I like to do nothing. At the weekend, I usually play music. Uh, I play drums in a few bands, so that's my main hobby. I like to play guitar. I play in a band with some of my friends. So usually I play guitar and sing. And I play with my cats. Uh, I like to watch uh, many channels about travel. I like to watch a channel called Abroad in Japan. Um, I... Ooh. Okay, well I like, uh, I like news channels, I want to know what's happening in the world, and I like football channels as well. I usually like vloggers who travel the world because I enjoy listing down the next country that I will visit. Drumming videos, like learning how to play drum videos, those are my favourite ones. Uh, I usually listen to music, but no, no, no specific. Um, usually I like to watch something about eating and cooking foods or some video game ones or some uh, concerts as well. I don't think I watch and use YouTube very often. I watch the news on YouTube. Yes, I know it's a game, uh, but I've never played it. Robots. Um, I've heard of it, but I, I only know from students talking about it. No, I actually found out about Roadblox last year. Uh, I do, but I've never played it. <laughs> I do know Roblox. 
I've never played it, but I know lots of my students like to play uh, Roblox and Minecraft. What's a Roblox? My favorite moment in Sagachula is uh, going to the canteen to have lunch every day. The best moment was Sports Fest last year at the champion of Musical Chair. But recently, I really enjoyed the Sports Day. I think all my students thought it was very funny. Uh, it's very interesting to watch the students develop. There are some students I teach them in P3, and uh, I teach, I see them around the school, and uh, I can say hello to them. And then maybe I can teach them again in P6. So it's very interesting to see the difference when the students understand something difficult or they enjoy the game. I get really sad when my P6 students leave and go to Matyam. Um, and so my, my greatest achievement in Matyam would be to see my students grow up from when they were young right up to when they leave at P6. If you want to learn English, you need to be confident and always try your best. Don't worry about making mistakes because making mistakes is how we learn. To help our students. Um... I think just um, there's so much you can do outside of school. So you, you know, watch YouTube, watch English cartoons, read English books. Read in English about something that you like. You know, when you go on holiday, talk, talk English to people. Just make it your hobby. <laughs> Try your best, keep studying hard, and if you see me, say hello, Teacher Connor. Study hard. Emotional, damn it! Bye-bye. Bye. Okay, bye. Thank you. Bye. Okay, bye-bye. Thank you. Bye. Bye, everybody. <laughs> Always aim high and shoot for the stars. And even if you missed it, you'll always land on the moon. You are.